Hello, and thank you for tuning in. You are tuned in to The Encourager. Happy Friday, T-G-I-F. Right? Uh, for me, that doesn't stand for thanks. thank God. <laughs> thank God it's Friday. It's, um, uh, uh, it stands for a number of different things. I guess it changes from Friday to Friday. <laughs> but, um went to, uh, was uh, doing laundry this morning, okay, and um, many synchronicities as usual, and by the way, hello, uh, uh, subscribers, thank you so much as always, I never want to overlook you and your willingness to take a chance and click play. Um, so thank you so much subscribers and and I almost forgot we hit 100 subscribers overnight okay 113 when I look down at the timer so we know those of you who has been with me for a minute we know that divine timing was to end the journal on 531 reach 100 subscribers Okay, and that uh, the sperm donor video, 332 likes when I checked uh, probably an hour ago. It might be at 333. That's the day of the year that I was born. This lifetime. Okay, 333rd day. That's 1129. Okay. So the synchronicities and everything are stunning and amazing and beautiful. And uh, so I wanted to talk just so for a moment, and I'll be posting another video, maybe before this one actually, uh, just thanking everyone for the 100 subscribers. But um, I want to talk about, and some, some special mentions, okay, that I will um, be mentioning in that video. So anyway... How can we, what are some little things? Let's talk about the little, so we talk about the big things, all the heavy lifting. So the chakra meditation, activation, and, and, and um, uh, energy cleansing baths and, and, and egg cleanses. And, and so we're talking about all of these things, dark night of the soul and all of these things. These things are heavy things. These things are things that are difficult to carry. So let's talk about some lighter things. What are some easy things that we can do in the 3D that are really, really, and so when I mean really, really easy, the things, the, the, the subtle, the small little things when divine is guiding us, Horus is guiding us, universe is guiding us, when our spirit guides are guiding us here in the 3D, there are little things that we miss. I notice these things about myself, and so again, this is why I bring these things to, to those who are ready for them, okay, on this platform. So, and thank you, because this is also how I get information is through your energy so so it's like a tarot reader not everything that a tarot reader says is for you there are little nuggets here and there and some things that a tarot reader says is for the tarot reader okay and I like saying tarot by the way I pronounce some things Interestingly, so I don't like saying vase, I like saying boss. I don't know why. It's weird. I don't know. Call me snooty or what. I don't know. Maybe that's from another lifetime when they use the word boss instead of vase. But I don't like saying vase. I don't know why. Sounds like vice. I don't know. <laughs> Someone's in a vice. Someone has vices. Something. Um, so. 
I was doing laundry this morning, as I mentioned, and anytime I get done with a washer or a dryer at a laundry facility, um, I always spin the barrel, right, to make sure there are no socks or anything stuck anywhere, right? And when I was doing that this morning, Divine Source showed me how that is something that is very easy to do. It takes a second. But even if most people's consciousness tells them to spin it, spin the barrel, to see if there's anything else, I don't know what spin the barrel means, that's probably, that has meaning for something else, right? Spin the barrel. Um, <laughs> I remember this, uh, this game we used to play uh, when we would tailgate at uh, for UF parties, University of Florida data parties, right? Tailgating parties. As a teenager, we played this game, the bat, like the spinning bat game. I don't even know what the game is called. Somebody knows. Anyway, the spinning bat drinking game, whatever that game is called. We had like beer drinking, spinning recliner chair games, just silly stuff, you know. Um, and uh, and so. <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah. So you put your head on this bat, right, and spin around, spin around, spin around so many times and stand up and try to walk a straight line. And I remember one time we were doing that and uh, my uh, my best friend, Scott, my brother, he's really a brother. Uh, Scott is <laughs> um, almost literally knocked himself out. I'm so glad he did not. We were all obviously a little plastered, um, but he nearly fell into this, like hit his head on this tree and root, big old root that was, this tree was wider than three people would take to wrap their arms around it. You know what I mean? This tree was huge. And, um, anyway, um, and so, I don't know why I was telling that story. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, so spinning that barrel around to look for the sock or the pair of underwear or whatever might be stuck wherever. It might be changed, something that fell out of a pocket, right? Whatever, okay? Um, so let's say you don't do that. And again, very simplistic example. You don't do that. You get back to the house and you're wondering where that other sock is because you're tired of losing socks in the dryer to the dryer monster. But because you are, fun because, not you, because the individual is functioning in a low vibration state or lower vibration state, they are not consciously aware of when their consciousness said spin the barrel, turn that barrel because there's something stuck. 824, that's 333. Okay? Or 888. So, um, so, what, uh, and 888, not 333. And so what that, what that individual failed to recognize that could have saved them, even from that little bit of heart, hardship of moving the sock. Again, simplistic. But think about it on a grander scale. Okay? When your consciousness says, don't go that way today, go this way. You've been going that way for seven years. Why are you going to go this way? Because today, your divine ancestors, your, 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 your higher self, and that's all, all of it is, your higher self, said, go the other way today. Why? Who knows? Something you'll see, something you'll avoid. Who knows? Okay? These little bitty things can help us. You leave the house, something in you says, grab the umbrella. But you're like, no, it looks sunny outside. So you don't grab the umbrella. Three minutes after you leave the house, it starts raining. Guess what? You're walking. You are far enough away from the house to where now you have to run back and you're soaked. 
and mad, and you didn't get to enjoy your walk. The little things, the little, 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 ten ten, little bitty things, little bitty things that could make our life so much easier here in this 3D. Let's not talk about government and all that's going on and all of that and all of that again. It's all a spiritual battle. It's all a spiritual battle. And when you understand that, you'll see again that there's no need for picketing or anything because you will come to realize that you cannot fight a spiritual battle with picketing around a building. You will, you will come to realize that, that you can't beat racism, systemic racism, by picketing and talking about Black Lives Matter. You will realize you can't do that from there. 1101, okay? So little things, everyone, little things. What are those little things? And I don't want to make us so paranoid. Again, that's something that we all have to be careful of, not to be paying so much attention, like we're so intense about looking at it, like that we burn a hole through whatever we're looking through. Because No, 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 no. Step back. Step back. You're way too close. Step back. Okay? 1129. Step back. Okay? But pay attention to those little bitty things. Okay? Now, when I leave the house, I double and triple check keys, cards, and stuff like that because I, I've caught myself so many times Right? Forgetting, and I'm like, okay. Right. So, before I go, my hand's on the doorknob, I'm getting ready to leave the house, let me run through real quick. Okay. Anything else? Source, divine, ancestor, anything else I need to grab? Even if it has nothing to do with whatever I'm doing, the plans, the whatever. I might be on my way to a business meeting or something. I might be on my way to hang out with friends. Okay, but something says grab something that is completely unrelated to what my plans are that day. Grab whatever that is. Okay, grab that. All right. Thank you so much as always for tuning in. My name is Nehru. You've been tuned into the Encourager. We are finishing up the journal covering 2016 to 2024. We are finishing up that journal today. So there will be probably two videos um, finishing up that journal. At least that's all I hope it takes anyway. So thank you so much as always for tuning in. If you would like to get in touch with me, you can find all of my social media links and email address in the information section of this video. And uh, to, again, to our new subscribers, thank you so much. And again, I will be posting that uh, thank you for 100 subscribers here uh, today as well. Enjoy your day, and as always, be encouraged.